bananas, cookie, cookie dough. dough, chocolate sauce, uh, whipped cream. Did you say sprinkles? I don't know. I'm running out, but <laughs> we'll do a montage. Cookie dough is my favorite topping. I'm gonna keep track. Do not eat raw dough. That's a suggestion. Oh, sprinkles! Like, it's Super Bowl of football is your thing, and we're f***ing that up, so. I don't wanna fumble it! <laughs> That'll be the intro scene! Cut. <laughs> Welcome, everybody. Today, as you can kind of see before you, we have our Super Bowl, well, our 21 pounds. Today, as you can see before you, we have our 21 pounds of Super Bowl Sunday. Super Bowl Sunday. We got four types of ice cream, vanilla, chocolate, strawberry, cookies and cream, half a dozen donuts. For a grand total of 22,000 plus calories, four pounds of delicious sugar, this one's probably gonna hurt. You'll notice most of the cookie dough is placed on my side because that's my favorite topping. She has more brownies, edge pieces, of course, on her the side. The full pound of brownies did not make, even make it into the sundae. Did not. She ate a few of them ahead of time. So, without further ado, here we go. Least favorite nuts, but yeah. they, the texture was the right. I like almonds more, but I feel like they would have been they, those would have been little frozen shards. Mm -hmm. Walnuts have too much fat to really get hard. Yeah. Oh my god, all the brownies are hiding over here. I don't think all the brownies are hiding. That's all that's left oh. in your brownie. Oh, oh god. <laughs> 
Gideon, did you see that? It's for Gideon OG. Mm -hmm. Dropped on the floor. Mm -hmm. But she actually took blame mm -hmm. for that one. How many pounds do you think we're down? Half. We're spread on half. Maybe. Enough. Oh, the middle's pretty dead, so. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it goes down pretty deep. So we both agree, generally speaking. These end pieces and corner pieces of roundies, those are our favorite parts. However, in here, mm. not the case. So I got a couple of the corner pieces and tear your mouth apart. I'm surprised you got any corner pieces. Those are the ones that went first was before an, they even made it into an the center. Piece. It was an edge piece, right. yeah. mm. so I was snacking on the brownies and um, the walnuts before even yeah. topping the sundae. I couldn't like, help it, these brownies were made at like 11 a.m. I feel like I'm baking with my kids here. <laughs> you yeah. lick the bowl. How is it any more civilized than someone who just needs a brownie? That batter is left over. It's going to waste <laughs> if I don't eat it. Because it is waste. It belongs in the trash. How dare you? Are you team middle brownie? Edge brownie? <laughs> Still no breakthroughs. You think if you really focused, you could have done this whole thing by yourself? It depends on the time. I, I would have had to try to do it for speed, I think. <laughs> but I had to try to do it for speed, and I wouldn't need to know. I would have like kind of prepped for it ahead of time. Actually, I think I, I think I would have given up just for being cold before yeah. I got full. Was there money on the line? <laughs> Are you capable of superhuman feats when there's money on the line? You'd be surprised if yeah. there's money. <laughs> I beat you a few times this year with money on the line. I beat Stoney with money on the line. So apparently, yes. I'm, I'm capable of leaving my body and accomplishing <laughs> things I'm not capable of. Oh, I'm cold. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get a ton of coffee. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just put on this thing. Yeah, I don't think it's too, too hot. And for anyone wondering, when she gets to how cold it is, we're about 70 in your apartment right now. We're right by windows. And it's like it's closer to 67. It's cold. Let's see, I replay this video. How many bowls of ice cream I've gone through? <laughs> I'd say, I didn't empty out each one. Oh, that would have been a, a fun way to check. I mean, I wanted more of like a different flavor and started topping it off. That's even worse! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, actually, even less than you thought I did. <laughs> we got strawberry ice cream, brownies. We got lemon. Oh, oh, I just smeared strawberry all over my bed. Sorry, football. <laughs> I just got pink all over it. Oh, well. That's what it is. And she literally coats the entire thing. <laughs> 360 degrees. Like, could have just left it alone. It would have been fine. Like, I didn't want to get it dirty. <laughs> I, I didn't want the, the, the laces to get dirty. There's really not much left. Mm. Here we got this. Almost dead. Are we not doing this nicely, are we? Just <laughs> crack it with the knife. 
Yeah, I can try to like fry it. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Whew. Cold. This is beautiful. <laughs> All right. All right. Actually, oh, the cutting board. Can we move the stuff off that cut? Bring the cutting board over here. Here, I'll switch you.2,000 calories, a little bit more than that, um, around 1,500 plus grams of sugar. So roughly four pounds, you're equivalent to four pounds of sugar. What? Total. So I was at 20 pounds Sunday, four pounds, pure sugar? Roughly, yeah, a little under, yeah. So you average bag of sugar, also roughly right around four pounds. That doesn't make it sound as it's friendly. It's okay, because there's like 111 grams of fiber. And we got a protein too. Yeah, and there's like 350-ish grams of protein. But what you're telling me is that if you were to make that same Sunday in just a normal portion, still, so if ours was 20, uh -huh. and four pounds of that was pure sugar, yeah. one-fifth of what you're eating would be pure sugar. Yes. Well, yeah, that's how math works. So, I mean, if you, if you made a scaled down version, 20% of anything you're eating being pure sugar is kind of ridiculous. I guess I'm gonna have to cut this part out of the video, but that'd really. Be, that'd be an adorable little football one. <laughs> it would be adorable. <laughs> so, 22,000 plus calories, roughly four pounds equivalent of sugar. How many grams of fat? <laughs> a little over a thousand grams of fat. So about 45% of the calories. It'd be like two and a half pounds of fat. So four pounds of sugar, two and a half pounds in fat. Now, honestly, I feel like I've seen that amount of sugar dumped into like a pitcher of sweet tea. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, so if you drink your calories, you know, stop wagging your fingers at us. I have more coffee than you. It's cold, but. This is not sweet. Oh god, if you had cream and sugar and your coffee on top of it all, mm. I would have lost it. Oh. Mm. Boom. That's a dumb last piece. <laughs> That's a football's butthole for the final bite. <laughs> There you have it. That was a 20 plus pound Sunday, complete with four pounds of sugar, two and a half pounds of fat, <laughs> four tubs of ice cream, a billion toppings, two pots of coffee, one cutting board later. <laughs> I call this challenge a success. You guys like what you see? And you like me spilling coffee all over myself? Uh, shoot us a comment down below. <laughs> Let us know what you like about this or any suggestions that you guys may have. We had a lot of fun making this, so if you want to see more Mick and Nick in the kitchen, let us know in the comment section down below and uh, we'll whip up some fun creations together. So until next time... We're out. <laughs>
21 pounds. Jesus. <laughs> Sorry, it's just very Just, 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 just try it, just try it. Okay, okay.